How do we quantify the power of influence? Does the person with the biggest following win? If so, what are they bringing their following to? Clothing, hair care, attention getting gimmicks? What about truly life enhancing direction? In a recent podcast, we observed biblical examples of influencers. Some were in positions of authority, but others had no public voice. One example, a young girl, maybe 10 years old, she was a nameless servant in the home of a great Syrian warrior who had an incurable disease. Her few words essentially changed this warrior's life. That's powerful influence. And it was from a nobody. Do you see the encouragement for those of us who don't have social media's promoting power? Click the link in the description to hear our recent podcast episode, How Can We Become Influencers Part 2? We discuss nameless biblical influencers, the influence of Moses with his lack of confidence, compared to Nehemiah, whose rise to influencer was legendary. Join us as we learn from these humble biblical figures. Godly influence is within your reach. Thanks for watching, liking, and subscribing.